Addressing a news conference in Zaria, Kaduna State, Northwest Nigeria, Professor Duri stated that if the shortage of pat leather and other palms input continues to escalate, all Nigerians will face a food crisis. So these are basic things that I think government should, as a matter of urgency, subsidize agric by making sure that the inputs, seedling, fertilizer, herbicides, all of them are so expensive. Government to intervene because fertilizer is a major input for agri production. They should intervene by reining in those major players who kind of have monopoly power that has been controlling the output and the price at the same time. So that farmers, especially pizza farmers, can be able to afford to buy four bags, three bags of fertilizer to go to the farm, at least to produce what they can eat. Also speaking, Professor Peter Njiporti noted that without subsidizing the price of fertilizer and ensuring security in rural areas, agricultural production in Nigeria will be in jeopardy. We are thinking that government ought to have, which is still not late because in this axis, farmers are still preparing, more especially going toward the Sudan Sahel, like Sokoto, Zamfara, Kasina, and the rest of them, farmers are still preparing. It is in the northwest, let's say Kaduna and others, that uh, people have started planting, yet others are still preparing because the rain is yet to come fully. We are fully aware that our farmers depend on rain fed. Fertilizer will be readily available at affordable prices by the masses because if you look at the bulk of these farmers, especially in villages, are poor. Some of them can barely afford to get maybe just a tier of fertilizer. Talk less of getting a bag which is going for almost about 40, 40 something, 40 something thousand. Both professors advise that to achieve a bumper harvest, the federal government must encourage more investment and supply of pat leather to peasant farmers to foster competitions in the market. Yusuf Kudan, AIT News, Kaduna.